Hello and welcome back to Chimera Squad. Wow. Fucking Grey Phoenix, right? These guys. They are everywhere. <laughs> anyway, I still don't have my bloody armor. Ultimately, it turns out it's not a super big deal because I'm, I'm still surviving. But, I mean, it would help a lot. One utility item slots, even that would be nice, and two HP. So, we gotta decide the next mission. We are just training the melee guy and uh, getting some money. Actually, we would get that money a lot earlier if I didn't fuck up earlier as well, so... Uh, big bummer. But at least we found out... I'm actually not gonna click right now, <laughs> because I don't want to mess it up. That you can only have one guy in there. So, that's basically dedicated to getting money. <laughs> uh, yeah. And now we have a choice between either getting Illyrium, which you guys know I love, or getting 55 creds from the smugglers. <clears throat> and normally I would say, fuck yeah, Illyrium. I, don't, I have not once visited the scavenger market, because apparently you spent intel there, and I'm also super broke with intel, so it's even pointless to go there. I mean, <laughs> what's the point? I, I can imagine it. You go in there and like, hey, it's like going to a merchant with no no gold. It's it's not gonna be good. I, I suppose we can save. Like, do we want a safe scum to check the merchant? I wouldn't buy anything. I would not go in there. But like, just to see that how how does it even look like? But at this point we have to go for illyrium uh smuggler and 55 uh creds because we're gonna get 75 creds from uh this guy glad handing and uh that will allow us to buy the armor for 200 and that's gonna be an upgrade that's a clear upgrade and yeah so i think i will take the smuggler here just for that it's, it's a little close. Usually I will be taking uh, Illyrium, but now we will take credits. Because I kind of need credits. Yeah, I know it. So, Zephyr is also less, follows a pair of leaders, less wounded now. Mutons. Custodian Zell handles their technical interests. Okay. You know more about crew chief Yarvo, who directs their martial pursuits. Zell and Yarvo are unknown quantities. It isn't clear who caused the shots between them. I called the shots. Shots in the face. Okay, training complete. The parts of your dossier that aren't sealed suggest you had a role in the nice. 2015 invasion. Remove agents weakened I know you HP. Ask, but you do not want to okay. know. Just tell me this. Did you regret it? Any of it? Why do you think my dossier is sealed? That's not an answer. It is not the answer you want. But it is the answer that is best for us both. Okay, we're gonna put Godmother... Uh... On a... I don't know, a cleanse? Fucking a spiritual getaway? And for for that time, we're gonna have Zephyr on the team. I suppose we're gonna change a little bit uh, the the loadout. What? Bust weapons shipment. Lost and found. So let's see what we got here. 50 intel and lower the unrest. Also, we stopped the unrest. Holy crap. Because the unrest is going up by 3, here, this is 1 rest unrest, and also we are preventing 3, 1 AP rounds. I kind of like the AP rounds, I, I kind of want to buy one of these. Do I value AP rounds or the intel? I kind of value both. I think probably the AP rounds would help me fight, the, the intel would not help me much too, right now. Two days toward Operation Reveal, uh, minus two unrest in the Riverside District, and 30 credits. Hostages are present in this on this mission as a sub-objective. <clears throat> I 
do I want to speed up the the mission? That doesn't seem super smart. Right? I don't know. Is it is it smart? It doesn't seem super smart. Search. I mean, this seems to give me the most bang for buck because we are getting rid of free and also we are getting 50 intel and we're getting rid of two. So this is like effectively a five. What if I freeze district unrest over here? So this will not go up and we go here, get 50 intel. We, we have to manage the unrest most of all. And this is how we do it. I'm not sure how we drop this. Illyrian is spent to power projects in the assembly. What? Completing an investigation removes three points. Okay, so you really want to avoid any unrest. Oh, fuck. Gain extra situation rewards. I mean, that helps. Reduce city anarchy. I mean, that's that's just the one-time thing. I mean, getting more rewards, that seems pretty fucking good. I mean, isn't that like one? Isn't this like a one-time thing? It kind of sounds like a one-time thing. But yeah, I think the next step is just to get something to rank free, and we gotta go to downtown with this squad. If a hostile force will cause imminent harm, you'll need to stop them by any means necessary. No way. As always, subduing targets is preferable. We learn far more from captures than corpses. Well, I'll, I'll try. It's not that easy. The game is uh, getting more difficult. Launch. <laughs> or at least feels that way. I need the armor. I mean, it's not too bad. I'm not super late with the armor. Because I, I kind of rushed the armor. Uh, I didn't even know about it. Like, If you think I just cheesed it, uh, I didn't. Hostiles. Breach when ready. I just went with the recommended. But it also seemed to make sense. Okay. Surprise. Successful shots on enemies during breach will stun. Not bad. Last unit uh, through this entrance will have their weapon disabled. Not the best. Last unit through this entrance gets one armor for the encounter. So we can just stun everybody. But one guy will have uh, their weapon disabled. One armor for the encounter. I mean, that would be good on the melee guy. This is six six guys. I mean, that's better because less likely. Terminal. We're gonna come here because there are less guys here. We see. Less we have to deal with. And we can just stun everybody and punch people in the face. Time to breach. Yeah, we're not dealing with that. Praetorian. Yeah, that's a problem. Uh, faceless. A legionnaire. Interesting. Uh, let's take a shot at him. Can we finish off the Legionnaire? It is not guaranteed though. I can just keep stunning people. Praetorian gets stunned, the Berserker gets stunned. Let's stun the Praetorian. Okay. Well, he's stunned, so he will not shoot me, but. I mean, we don't have to. Yeah, fine. Uh, let's finish off. 
the legion there if you can Stun too. You don't have to stun the melee guys too much. Because they gotta be out in the open anyway. A Praetorium. I, maybe I can make the Praetorium Berserk. Okay, let's see who is a problem. The Bruiser will act early. The Praetorium will act early as well. What if I make the Praetorian act right now? I guess the Bruiser won't act early anymore. Uh, we can take a shot at the Praetorian. Or the Faceless. Berserker. Not a big deal right now. <sighs> the Praetorian is hard to kill. That's why we need armor round armor piercing rounds. Which are which is gonna cost me money. Berserker. The Berserker would be a nice target for the melee guy. Yeah, let's see. The Dominator is is super annoying. But we cannot target it. The Faceless is probably not a concern. The Berserker is pretty far away. Doesn't seem like a concern. Uh, let's shoot at the Praetorium. What we have here? Ceasefire Grenade. Wait. This is like a 1 out of 1 encounter. Seems that way. Yeah, he always goes up in armor. Oh, you wanna do me? Oh, that hurts. We don't see the Berserker from maybe here. Uh, can we kill the Faceless? That's a pretty low first hit. A second hit could be a finisher. So we don't have to deal with that guy. I don't like his mind control. Side is able. Heal me! Okay, Zephyr what gets healed. Spray do its work. We gain... We give one action, or just go for a shot. Do I want to give one action? Zephyr. I mean, he won't be able to do too much with it. Um, it might be better off that I shoot the Praetorian. Okay. Uh, the Paladin is coming up. The Praetorian is still coming up. So we killed the Praetorian. Smashing extremity. Unconscious apparently. But we're just gonna go for a uh, tankiness here. Mine merch. The Paladin just made himself a target. But to be fair, it's kind of hard to get him and the berserker is a little bit in the way
What if I make the Berserker Berserk? Enemies all around you. Unsettling. Every time. He doesn't have... I guess he can act with one action point. And he can move and attack. He would have smashed someone. In the vicinity. Demolishing. Yeah, also we can't crit with this punch. Disoriented. Come on. We just need one shot. That would be so good. Come on. Forty percent chance to kill two at the same time. The dominator is not loving it. Oh, he's going for a mind control. Should be the healer. Okay, I can give extra action to Zephyr. I mean, it's not even close by. A nearby unimpaired ally. I mean, it's not not that nearby. Okay, extra action, but only one extra action. So we gotta go for a punch here. And uh, maybe a shot. And the berserk is removed. Wow, what a fucking easy ride. Some missions are damn easy. But some are damn hard. <laughs> okay. Not bad. Uh, Cherub completed spec up. Glad handing. We got money! Woo! Hey, Zephyr. What are you up to? Will I ever get new, new uh, so agents? Why do you let her talk to you like that? You can't force friendship. But you can reach out and let someone know they aren't alone. So I do. Hey, Nokov. I need a new training dummy. We spar in five. I will be there. See? Progress. Or a concussion. Can't wait to see which one. Will I ever get new guys? <laughs> Promote agent. Uh, promotion to rank special agent has unlocked a mind flay. Verge lashes out with their mind, uh, dealing mental damage to all enemies on the neural network. Damage from mind flay will render enemies unconscious instead of killing them. What? That's kind of the same thing the caller does. What? I feel ripped off. <laughs> How much damage it does? I guess we find out what we got here. Promote agent. Okay, choice. First shot in each clip disorients the target. <sighs> I'm not even sure what disorient does. Blue Blood automatically activates Overwatch if the last action of their turn is spent moving. Wow. Includes using uh, abilities that can provide movement such as sub, do and stabilize. Almost every single time I'm just double shooting with him, so unlikely. First uh, shot in each clip disorients the target. I mean, that seems okay. I can get on board with that. But let's go. Let's go. I'm not even sure how, how many bullets we got. And da -da -da -da. in the pistol, five shots, three to four damage. Ah, oh, that's fine. Seventy-five creds. Nice. How about go and get more seventy-five creds? This is great. So we're just gonna keep getting crats here. And we're gonna use the money to 
go and get the armor upgrade for everybody. And we're gonna get utility item slots and plus HP. Fucking amazing. But we're also super broke again. Uh, that doesn't matter too much. Now with a little reflection on these items. I would say like extra padding is super not worth it. I like flashbang. A lot. Medikit is... Meh. First reload in a mission does not cost an action. I mean, this could be okay. With a pistol. Because... Else you just sacrifice one bullet. These rounds grant 5 aim, five aim to an agent when equipped. Uh, that's basically useless. Smoke grenade. I would take another flashbang grenade. I don't think we need it. Actually, I pro I'm pretty sure that we, we're just fine with one. But I, I would feel safer if we had two. And I guess an auto key card would be nice too. Assembly. We're slowly getting there. Improving field teams is a priority, apparently. We're not gonna switch. We're just gonna get the assault rifle one. But yeah, I mean, field teams can be upgraded to rank two. Yeah, I will get that. It doesn't cost us much. Okay, let's see. Sorry about that. So we can get 50 intel here. Oh my god. That's an outbreak. Emergency. We can get 50 intel. It's locked. We, we cannot do that. Yeah, I mean, it's getting troublesome. We can't deal with this. Now now I have to sacrifice 50 intel just to deal with two... Uh, fire. <laughs> Outbreak! And it's also very difficult. Wait, it's Thursday. I guess I should spend my intel. I can get extra credits on Friday. Okay. But we still gotta deal with the outbreak, right? I hate it, but I think we have to. Because if this fills up, we lose. The city unrest fills up. It's actually 2 out of 14. There's not much room to dick around there. Need the infection target. Seven days. But what will happen here? This will just keep going up? And we can't reach it? Or... I don't know. The main difficulty doesn't seem to be the... The, the, the fights are just crazy, crazy difficult. Impossibly difficult. But... Oh, grandmother... I mean, uh, godmother is still training. We're still getting the bucks. I think we have to deal with this. There's just no Hostile ignoring forces it. forces aren't our only problem. Advent left many dormant threats in its wake. If the city faces an outbreak, 
It's our responsibility to protect civilians from this threat. All right, let's launch. Agent synergies are important. Don't be afraid to experiment the new agent co uh, combinations. Well, how about give me some new agents? Civilians in imminent danger. Keep them safe. I don't even care that they are less experienced than the, my old ones. Just fucking give me new ones. Successful shots on enemies will crit. Uh, how do we do this? Let's go verge. Into Zephyr, into Blue Blood, into Terminal. Let's go. Time to breach. What? Berserker. So that Legionnaire is a bit of a problem. I can just lift him up, but that I would do instead of my turn. And he's not really crazily in cover, so I'll just take a shot at him. Wow. Uh, fearless advance. Uh, let's do it on the python. Uh, try to deal with this. Wait. Lancer shot? Okay, I guess we're gonna lance a shot on the legionnaire. Let me just uh, finish him off. I just don't want to get shot on the way in. Nice! Okay, this is a one turn ordeal. Uh, we can team up, move up terminal right away. And... Do we want to make someone stupid? The Dominator is annoying. Uh, when it comes to shots, the Berserker is the best choice. Hmm. The Paladin. Okay, how about I make the the Dominator Berserk? Nice. What else we got? Wait, we also got Mind Flay, but... I actually managed to distort some cover. You know, I might just take that. Okay, let's give someone an extra action. We can give Zephyr an extra action. As far as single actions are concerned, Zephyr is actually pretty decent. I set him up, you knock him down. Now, do I want to spend my time punching this Berserker? Yeah, this Berserker will act. Like that. Uh, next up, we can finish off the Berserker, and that's the only thing we can shoot anyway. Wait, what? Wait, wait, him. No, oh, you fucking bastard! Civilian was killed. Two casualties remaining, so that's that's all I can deal with. Uh, I can get into the face of this berserker. Smashing so extremity. He doesn't go for more civilians. Okay. 
Let's parry. Mm. I'll go for a regular shot. He's not disoriented. Perfect. And uh, finishing blow would need to be a bit lucky. Still decent. So we got Verge, and he can't do much here. Can finish off the Berserker. I guess he's just gonna come closer and take a shot at the Berserker. Crossing over. Gotta get moving. I understand the riots now. If this is what citizens has to deal with, holy shit, they are right. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry. Not everyone will die. Well, we captured enemies, so... Zephyr is actually pretty good at capturing too. Also Verge. I fucking hate to admit it, but I kind of like Zephyr now. <laughs> well, if he... I don't know, he levels up again and gets something useful. Like, double punch. Holy shit. He, if he gets double punch, I will straight up like him. Looking to sink your teeth into something delicious? Why not give Burger Palace a try? Okay. We have Field, team, payday. Uh, 30 bucks, uh, 10 intel, and uh, 20 illyrium. Nice. Okay, we heal that. She cannot do anything right here anymore. So, she might as well be a uh, part of the team. Promotions ready. Oh my god, let's promote him. Has unlocked crowd control. Zephyr quickly darts around and attacks everybody near uh, nearby enemy before returning to their original position. Two turn cooldown. Wait, what? What? You attack every nearby enemy with a punch every two turns. No ammo. Oh my god, Zephyr, what the fuck? You start out so garbage. Like, irredeemably so. And now you're kinda redeeming yourself. He's definitely the most improved. I mean, he straight up started as the person who just cannot kill one basic guy. Just runs in. He didn't even have defense. He just ran in. And... Ran out at best. Ran in, did nothing, ran out. <laughs> and he went down as well, once. And now he, now he's pretty good. He couldn't even subdue. When, when I punched people in the face, he couldn't even fucking subdue. But now, I don't know, it kind of depends on the area of this crowd control. But like, this could be ridiculous. Maybe not as good as uh, what uh, Godbutter has, but I, I think... Maybe even better. Uh, okay, the assault rifle is almost finished. That's that's a problem. Wait, what? I guess we gotta deal with that. that that's a concern as well. So... Well, we have someone in Spec Ops getting money. And we can't take him out. Uh, there's no not much point s sending someone in here. So I should take out someone who doesn't have an upgrade. Which is the healer. And I fucking hate to admit it, but it is the healer. So... Plus two... 
I mean, the plus two is the only thing I got. Wait, what? Even the healer has it? No, 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 that, that's the armor, right? Okay, um... I'm pretty sure that I never sent the healer in. I sent him Verge. So he can unlock potential. Hardening agent's response to live fire exchanges allows them to react calmly and think tactically even when under intense pressure. So 3 turns and 20 dodge. That's not as good as uh, 2 HP for 2 turns. What else we got? Terminal can get basic HP. Oh, they have different upgrades. So he can, uh, she can go for basic conditioning. Zephyr can go for two extra speed. Blue blood, I uh, can do jack shit. Godmother can do uh, the same. Uh, we're not gonna again look at cherub because uh, that might break the spec ops. So what we learned from this is terminal could really use some extra HP, even though. Being without the healer is not something I'm looking forward to. So here we're not only preventing two, but also getting rid of two. And I suppose this is what we have to prioritize. Most of all, uh, this would be a four. And this is a 4 as well. Although, this is a 4... That... Puts me down to 0. But this would put me up to 5. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! One free field team? Oh no, I, I, I thought like it's an agent. Fuck me. But one free field team, that's, that's at least... That's hard to say. I mean, it's probably level 1 field team, but even level 1 field team is uh, pretty high ranked right now. I mean, that that's like 100 intel right there. Illyrium is okay, too. Unrest in uh, the fringe district. I mean, this is pretty good. I mean, I, I just kind of hope to see field agent. I mean, I get it, game. Or at least I don't get it. I I'm, I don't get it. Okay, I don't get it all. Why not just give me agents? If we're lucky, we can reach an endangered VIP before hostile forces arrive. Uh, Our goal is to extract the VIP. No, no, no. That's that's the bad thinking. The what do you position? mean? If you're lucky. Get the evac and get out. That, that's not how we do things around here. Hoping to get lucky. I guess we. That's all we got. Uh, yeah, let's go. Poor robot. Never sees action. <laughs> that, that's probably for the best. Friendly VIP ready for evac. Hostiles on the move. Let's breach. All units entering here get 25 aim during the breach. All units through this entrance get 50 dodge for one round. Okay. Let's play like that. Time to move. What? That seems like a lot of people. Uh, let's go for the python in the back. Okay. We have a chance to kill the trooper right away. But this paladin will shoot at us. Do we want to off strike? Actually, yeah, I'm kind of being dumb here. But yeah, let's let's off a strike on the paladin. I should have Godmother uh, coming in later, so her off a strike is useful. I mean, 
at least in missions where it's one encounter. Yeah, we definitely want to kill that guy. Do I want to soften up the python? Or do I just not care? Maybe I want to soften up someone else. I see the VIP. Escort to the evac zone. Oh, I see. That's not useless. Still a use useful area to keep punching. But that's not exactly what I want to do. I, I guess I'll just kill this python right now. be hide and just parry um where are we taking this guy oh that way um how about you just wait a little bit you have 5 HP yeah just hunker down for now oh fuck it's even worse than I thought. Hmm. We can't really use the scatter shot. Seems that like that. Yeah, that would be nice. Killing the sh uh, the trooper. In one go. Seems like I can't climb up. I can't really flank the trooper. Also, the berserker is a concern. I don't want to get too close to it. I mean, that would be an okay spot, I suppose. This is only justifiable if he killed the Berserker for sure, and I think we will. We don't really have high cover here. Okay, obviously this is gonna take two shots. What? That was a terrible shot. Can I even shoot at the Berserker from over here? Unclear. Go, you're safe. Go. Oh, this is how we save civilians. I'm sorry, civilian, that was a mistake. Think fast. Nice. That's what I was hoping for initially. Wait, what? Bruiser, you're saving civilians too. Double time. Target acquired. Uh oh. Will the car blow up? You wanna duel me? Not a problem. Maybe a little bit of problem. Actually we don't have heals. Keep that in mind. I guess we'll just go away from the exploding car. Most likely exploding car. Uh, Legionary is far away. 
I can make it there. Grenade out. Okay. No shooting for you guys. And, uh, wow, Praetorian is the highest chance to hit. I want to kill the trooper. Come a little closer. I want a triple punch. More guys are coming in. Okay. So the plan is just to sneak in the guy on the right. Zephyr. Can do a heal. That doesn't cost an action. Unfortunately, I cannot target. That's, that makes more sense. Leaving Praetorian a little bit for later. Does this still give me? Uh, armor after that? No. So if we use that, then we don't have armor. Like parry. Okay, just move a little bit. a little bit safer now. So we can get closer and go for a, a kill on both of them. I mean, one of them. But at least the Victorian is Getting closer to it. Yeah, the trooper really should die. Alright, also don't want to blow up with the car. So, let's take this shot. Looks like I timed it just right. Fuck. It doesn't seem to be worth it unless we're hitting three or more. Because we... We also give up our, our shield. Hmm. Okay, let's come a little closer. No. I still believe we need to kill this guy because there's just a lot of people coming. Get out of here. Stunning him for one round doesn't necessarily help that much. Oh my god, explosion. Okay, well, explosion help a little bit there. But what the fuck? Can we kill the Praetorian? It is a guaranteed kill. So let's do it. Fracturing. And also gives us parry. Uh, this, why, this guy will keep moving in. Bruiser. Fuck me. Okay, moving over there. As much as I want to play it safe with him, but enemies will just keep coming. So we can't really play it safe that much. Uh, yeah, get 
close to the car that already blew up. Now let's just go for a shot on the bruiser. Yeah. About what you can expect. I guess he can stay a little bit back and cover. Pro flashbang grenades. Okay, who's gonna act? This trooper will act. The bruiser will act. Okay, so we're gonna take out this trooper. Sure. Of course, we need him to move as well. Uh, we can't do too much with that bruiser over there. Your thoughts. Let's just try to stun him. Okay, that's a good choice. And last, we're gonna kill this bruiser next to us. We need to fucking go, guys! Come on! What the fuck? Closing in. Four guys every round. I mean, we just can't kill them that fast. Okay, this guy needs to go down, that's for sure. Snake man. Snake man will make it soon. Wait, what? Damn soon. This round or the next. Okay, let's just punch this bruiser. He's rooted, but not stunned. Okay, go. Yeah, I mean, next round we will be there. Not right now. I'm running low. Okay, last shot. Uh, we can take it on the bruiser. Oh, the bruiser is kind of disabled. Okay, let's reload. Reloaded. Now, I no no no. We're not gonna go for a capture here. There's not even a point to it because, oh fuck, because she has dry. strength uh, bullets. Yeah, I mean he needs to start running in. Because next round we intend to extract. And he needs to be close to the extraction for that. Not okay. much ammunition. Uh, same thing for him. Uh, he can move one and shoot. But he definitely needs to move and... I guess I can My mind try to stun this guy. Then move. We're prepared for the extraction big time. Okay, we're almost there. Moving on target. More guys coming in? I don't think so. If only they Looking brought well. in the guys in the first place. Out. This would make more sense if I was was actually playing the like the, the legit XCOM in a way. Uh, this is like super legit XCOM by the way, like very awesome legit uh, XCOM experience. But what I'm saying is that when I'm playing the rebels in a way, and just more and more guys show up. But like when they are the rebels, like where are they getting all these reinforcements? Okay. That's a lot of dudes. And Verge will act last. Uh, I can go for a one punch in the face. Then go for the exit. 
He's rooted only. Evac! Okay, you evac for sure. What else? Well, you need to evac too. He's unconscious. Let's go. I'm not sure how we are taking him with us to uh, do the interrogation, but he'll find his way. Dropping target. Weapons running low. Okay. Uh, there's no point. I just go. Rolling out. Watch your step. Throw a flashbang grenade. Catch. They are going to feel that. I'm not even sure those are the guys <laughs> that are gonna come next. Doesn't matter. I can only reach those guys. Not great, but uh, Prep into we will probably survive. What would suck if some of them rooted me? Low on ammunition. That would suck. Time to go! Excellent rating. Runs to complete five. Yeah. Five enemies to 20 intel. I mean, that one... Uh, ...trank bullet is, is not the worst choice. Getting 20 intel all the time for the missions. I like that. Free fuel team. Nice. Enhanced assault rifles. So, what will you do when you retire? Get a boat or something? You always ask. What about you? Oh, I'm not going to retire. <laughs> of course you will. You can't do this job for too long. It gets to you. No, I mean... I know the odds. I have five years, tops, then a stray blast of plasma flash fries my lungs. <laughs> so why do this? Because I'm no good when I stop. I understand. More than you know. Come on. Terminal is the best. Okay, what we got here? Uh, sure. That's nice. Promotions ready? Uh, doo -doo -doo. God Mother fires a shotgun blast that is guaranteed to hit and destroy the target cover. Cost free ammo, free turn cooldown. Oh, nice. Nice. That's actually. Wait. If I knew about that, I would never go for flush. Right? I mean, I mean, I just don't really get value out of flush because flush just makes the target run into another cover. I mean, I suppose the main point of that would be that you just set up some overwatches and they run into the overwatch, I guess? I don't know. That's not my strategy, that's for sure. But they just don't run it out into the open. I guess uh, we're gonna be using ventilate a lot more. Uh, yeah, I guess we have that. Uh, what else? Uh, assembly complete. Enhance the assault rifles. New supply items. Enhance the AR. It's 130. And it gives 1 damage to all assault rifles. Agents affected, Verge and Sentinel. The fuck is Sentinel? Is that the... Okay. Is that the robot? Uh, this guy has a pistol. She... She has an assault rifle, doesn't she? I'm pretty sure she does. Uh, okay. I mean, yeah, I mean, if you had a team that just used assault rifles, I mean, this would be a pretty good upgrade. But my team is pretty mixed. So, for me, upgrades are difficult. Because I just use everything. And it's only one more damage. Enhanced submachine guns. Enhanced shotguns. Mastercrafted assault rifles. Breach explosives. 
I guess we're gonna go for this. It's three turns to do it. Allows us to improve the field teams. Let's do it. We're still waiting for the upgrades for the medic. Supply. Yeah, I don't know. I suppose at this point I would most likely buy the enhanced AR upgrade. We can uh, contact the scavenger market. Support a uh, 31 PT raid. Wow. Oh, that's... Okay, seems like there's just gonna be... We should use that to remove some... Let's actually keep going up. But I suppose at least I achieved something. Do we want 35 Illyrium or more credits? We just keep producing credits here. Anyway guys, uh, that's it for now. Uh, thanks for watching and see you next time.